the seventh greatest Super Bowl play, James Harrison's pick six. When I say top ten greatest plays in Super Bowl history, what's the first play that comes to your mind? Super Bowl 43, James Harrison interception. 18 seconds left of the second quarter here in Super Bowl 43. We showed an all-out blitz, and Kurt Warner thought that we were going to come out to bring the house. Steelers show blitz. He dropped back through the hot. James Harrison intercepted that pass. Up, and he just kept running. 25, 30. If you watch that play over and over again, there's at least four or five times where he should have been tackled. Kurt Warner had his shot. Larry Fitzgerald had his shot. I'm pretty sure Ken Wisenhunt had a shot at him. Missed the tackle. Get it! And all I remember is Larry Fitzgerald running down the sideline. And I'm thinking he's going to tackle him. He runs into his own guy on the sideline which slows him down just enough that James Harrison just gets in the end zone. That's what the defense do. We put points on the board. When you think of James Harrison, you think of a fire-breathing dragon, somebody who's crushing your quarterback. James Harrison, out of it. You don't think of James Harris doing like a Deion Sanders <laughs> and going like 100 yards down the field. Deion Sanders dancing for a long, long touchdown. When he scored that touchdown, and I'm, I'm pretty sure they brought out every oxygen tank that they could think of. Oxygen ain't enough. Somebody called him a size lady, man, let me get some acupuncture needles. Look at them halftime shows be like an hour, so he good. Had James Harrison stuck to his assignment, our number seven Super Bowl play would never have happened. 18 seconds before halftime, he sees Larry Fitzgerald and Quan Bowden, them two stacked up. He's got Bowden and Fitzgerald to the left. Pick route going on, because if you look at the past history of teams who played us, they always give Pittsburgh the pick routes in the red zone. Touchdown, and that's the Ane on the slant. James Harrison thinking like Spider-Man. My sixth sense come in. I can't make this blitz. I'm going to fall back. Kurt ain't expecting no James Harrison to fall back. Throw the ball right to him. And, and you know that you have to protect against James Harrison because he's such a great pass rusher. On that play, he faked like he was going to rush a passer, and he dropped back into the lane. Unbelievable. I would have put a higher. I, I, I really would. I don't know of a greater play on a bigger stage. I think it should be in the top five. The greatest running back in NFL history. Yeah! Who's picking these? The defensive player making an impact in a ball game right before the half. That has to be better than seven. What's really interesting what happens after the Harrison play, because Arizona comes back and has a great second half.